Welcome back. I'm April Ann Hurley, and you're watching California Living. And we're very excited. We're here with Chef Pac of the Silverado Resorts. Hi, April Ann. It's great to be here. I'm so excited. You know, first of all, because healthy food doesn't have to be boring. And I think you're going to show us, too, that it's quick, enjoyable, and let's face it, it's all in the presentation. Absolutely. Okay. And then this is where the sexy part comes in. Uh-huh. Right? Where we're going to use some vegetable garnish and the plain kefir we're going to use and mix with uh, some uh, some lime, okay. fresh lime, and some organ organic tequila, tequila lime, yum, and yum. salt. I mean, we can forget the kefir and just do the <laughs> tequila, lime, and salt if we want, but we're not going to because we're on a healthy, healthy binge uh -huh. tonight. And then we have uh, our our sexy garnish, which uh, is a little red beet, uh, some yellow beet. Now, if vegetables could be sexy, these are sexy vegetables. Yeah. You have to check it out, and Chef Peter is actually going to show us how to create these. No, you're gonna, you're gonna show us. Oh, how okay. To well, I only, I've only done this once, but I, but you know, and I'm she's a quick right learner. Handed, so we're gonna turn it over here. Okay. And uh, we have the, the uh, grating on, so we're gonna just use the beet first. Okay and absolutely just plug it in. And look how pretty they are. And press and, and turn. Okay. And it's that simple. Uh -huh. Little pressure here, April oh, Okay, okay like I'll, all the I'll way hold. you'll hold. And turn. Team effort. Turn. <laughs> and look at this. <laughs> look how so gorgeous. So we've got um, beautiful, here, this healthy, too. raw beets that are coming out of this uh, turning machine. How much fun is this? <laughs> look at that, that's gorgeous. And it's a, it makes for a great presentation, you can use it practically anywhere. Basically, just with this little apparatus, we're able to create confetti and all sexy kinds of vegetables. really sexy vegetables. I mean, I think even, you know, get your husband to eat them, the kids, everybody, look at that. And they taste good. Okay. So we'll show you how to put this together. Okay. First, we're gonna do the sauce and, and the recipe that you have, April Ann, is gonna be for six. Okay. I'm gonna make it for one portion, right. which is a, a couple ounces of uh, kefir and about a teaspoon. We don't want to overdo the tequila because we want to the show flavors. off the shrimp, we want to show off the kefir mm. and, and make everything blend. Uh, and then a, a, a squeeze of lime, fresh lime, and uh, of course, chef's favorite is mm. a little bit of salt. A little salt, yes. okay. So um, we'll mix that up. And of course, we'll have to taste it uh, to see if it's okay. They always show chefs doing that, you know? Doing that taste. See, because because it's it's not always perfect. I okay. think we need a touch more salt and a little bit of lemon. Okay. And then we're so good. I mean for the viewers, this is an interesting process too. What are they looking to create with those flavors so that they know a little more salt or a little more lime? Well, you know, it's balancing food and mm -hmm. uh, and wine. It's uh, making the wine taste good. If if acid and salt are balanced, then uh, the wine and the food taste good. Okay. So. It's the tequila trick. You balance uh, acid and salt and any wine will taste great. Excellent. So Excellent. here we go. We have some organic greens from Sassoon. Mm -hmm. um, Beautiful. With some mustard, yeah, with some mustard flowers. We're gonna use that as a base in the martini glass. So pretty. And then we're gonna use that as an anchor to, to anchor our vegetables, our, our red beets, which we're just gonna suspend uh, in our glass and let it hang over. Our yellow beets as well. We're gonna how kind of gorgeous! Sus suspend from the glass and let it fall down. The cucumber as well. There's a little strip here. But now, and where did you get this idea? Actually, from New Year's. Uh, uh -huh. I thought of New Year's and fireworks and confetti, and it all works. It does. And then on top of that, we'll, we'll pour our beautiful kefir mm. and yogurt and lime tequila sauce. Okay. And then to finish our main ingredient, which is the, the beautiful Oregon uh, Bay Shrimp. Those are so pretty. And we won't be skimpy with that. We'll no, a, go for it. Yeah, we'll put a few ounces <laughs> of that on. And then, of course, a, a beautiful lime and voila. garnish. And Look how go. gorgeous. And for the viewers, too, as far as the shrimp go, if they can't find this particular brand, a good, a good fresh frozen bay shrimp will do. Okay. Oh, okay, okay. So now the next step How about eating it? is trying you know? it. Yeah. Okay. And we're okay. going to give you a little bit of sauce. Okay. With some shrimp. Okay. And, and there you go, April. Oh, boy. Mm. 
Oh, so good. And then the vegetables are a little bit messy, so Have we'll fun. save that <laughs> for later. That is so yummy. Now, we did bring something to pair with that. Absolutely. And then, again, with the, the acid and salt balance, we have a beautiful Napa Valley Champagne. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So well, I think we should do a toast, April, I man. think so. Why don't you pour this? And as you mentioned earlier, if somebody didn't want to do alcohol, they can do a sparkling water? Absolutely. Or if they're beer drinkers, have some beer. You know, mm -hmm. anything mm -hmm. sparkling would be wonderful with this dish. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Napa Valley, Beautiful. huh? Yeah. They do it Beautiful. right. Yeah. So you want to try it? Taste it with it? Absolutely. Uh, let me give you this cute spoon here. Oh. <laughs> and we get a lot of the tequila Wow. Salt. That is so gorgeous. This could be a meal. Mmm. 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 Let's see how it pairs with this. I think it goes well. I think it does too. It's just wonderful. Really light and fresh and exciting. I mean, who would think that vegetables could be so exciting mixed with your kefir here, you know, and this is the plain, which doesn't have a flavor, and so your tequila and your lime really do come out. And a little bit of salt, you know. A little bit of salt. salt. Yeah, a little mm -hmm. bit of salt. The tequila factor. <laughs> <laughs> Well, this has been wonderful, and thank you so much for bringing all of these goodies and showing us and our viewers how to eat healthy and sexy. Thank you. Yeah. My yeah. pleasure. Okay. Thank you, April. Thanks for joining us for this inside look at healthy California living. I'm April Ann Hurley. And be sure to catch us next week for another look at why it's just more fun living in California.